Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, The Italian Makes It. Today I'm going to build a music box. Not my idea, not my creation. It's a kit that I bought and I really like it because I've built two more before in the past. One was a marble run and the other one is a music box. And they're all um, distributed by Raw Life. Let me show you the box. Here it is. So it's a music box. It's made in China, but Robo Time, two kits I built already. I have to say, they were like, I was quite impressed. So when I saw this, naturally, I thought, ooh, I have to build it. This, I need to do this. So here we go. I'm taking the chance to build this and show you and let you know what I thought of it and what I liked and what I disliked and what was good and what wasn't because when I built it previously there wasn't really any videos that um, showed you the reality of it of what it's like to build them so I take it up on myself <laughs> so I decided that I was gonna give it a go okay and in the box he says that rotated with your own fantasy song Will I have to make the music as well? That's not going to work for me, but let's see. And then the technology is laser printing DIY plus music. 92 pieces. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. I love the box. The box is designed really well. I don't know if you can see it, but he's got loads of little design things, loads of different squares, and I, I really like it. I really like it. So let's open it together because I cannot wait. I'm so excited. So I've got my little knife. Ta da! And the box is open. Let's have a look. <gasps> look at those colours. There's also like a little monkey inside and I think it moves as well I love it so here we go oh by the way this is for children above the 14 years old so I think I'm okay Ta -da! nicely packed and you even got like the little sanding paper so that's all the wood oh I love Oh, the smell of laser cut wood. I don't know you, but I, I love it. I absolutely love it. Then we've got the little card. Please scan the code. The instructions. A little glue. It's so cute, it's adorable. Oh, I guess this is the wax. And it comes with all the tools to do it. And this is the music box. So we're going to find out together what sort of music it is. So there we go. So we've got all the pieces. We have all the pieces. So let's start making. We've got all of the bits. I love it that it comes with everything that you need, including the little screwdriver to make the set. So you open it and you start making it. Look, it's a little screwdriver. I'm sorry, but I'm getting so excited about little things that are just, oh, so adorable. So I don't think we're gonna need the music box until later. So I'll put it on the side. There's the glue. That's the instruction manual, which tell us what what's inside. Ooh. And the instructions seem to be really good. And as you can see, all of the bits, all of the wood bits, 
they're all numbered and labeled so you've got the reference on the instructions on what you need to use and when so that's that's really good let's open this as well i've got a b c and d so I've lined them up all in front of me, I don't need this, all in front of me and I know this comes with the wax but the previous kit you needed the wax but it didn't come with it so what I did I bought this which is the wood balsam and that worked amazingly and I used some cotton buds so instead of using the wax, I will be using the wood balm and I'm going to be using it with the cotton buds and just rub it on all the clog cogs and um, where it's needed, basically. So I prefer this. I've used it before and it turned out amazing. So that's that. And then let's put these on the side. So uh, let's see. This is exciting. I'm very excited. We have now done step 1 to 11, so we're just about to do step 12, but I think we've done the most difficult part, um, which was putting all the mechanism inside, and now we're just going to build the top bit. So we've done the box, which is lovely. One thing, it's a little bit fiddly to try and to get um, the parts all together because they're very snug, but look, no gaps. No gaps and it fits perfect so I know it's a little bit fiddly but it's worth it so so worth it and um, we've got a little monkey this was challenging and to try and to put them all to align them to the distance that you needed to but I've done it so it's there now and all we need to do is attach it to the box and build everything else on top and another thing, I found out what music it's playing in um, the music box. It's Around the World in 80 Days from the 1956 movie, which I love it. And I, when I listen to it, I just can't get it out of my head. I'm not going to ham it because I'm not good at this sort of things whatsoever. So... I'll put the link in the description so you can check it out if you want to, unless you already know it. And if you like this video, why not subscribe and hit the bell so you can receive the notifications on the next videos. So now let's do the rest and finish the music box. Ta-da! 
it's finished. I'm very pleased with it. It looks amazing. I like it. And I can't wait to listen to the music and just watch the little monkey go around. Do, 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 do. Um, and what I'm going to do now, I'm going to talk to you about the pros and cons of this little beauty. The pieces smell amazing. I love the smell of laser cut wood. It's really, it's really nice and reassuring. I love it. So that is one of the pros. The colours, they're incredible. I hope they're going to come out. You can see them properly because it's, it's just amazing. Uh, uh, they're so vibrant and they're beautiful. So that's a pro. When you build it, the pieces fit really, really well together. I don't know if you can see it, but there are no gaps. There's nothing at all. So I would say it's even better than an Ikea kit. Also, all of the pieces are labelled with letters and numbers to make it easy to identify them when you're building. So that's a pro. Also, the instructions are really easy to follow and really well made because they tell you, I don't know if you can see it, but on every step you have the, the pieces, it tells you the label of the pieces that you need and then you can proceed and build it. And also it's got detailed uh, pictures of where each piece go. So pay attention to the instructions because they are really really easy to follow even for impatient me i can't believe it i managed to build that so that's an, that's the pro you have spare parts for some of the um more fragile pieces and so that's really good because i did break one of these actually um but i didn't realize i didn't realize that i was there and um I glued it, so not all is lost, even if you break one piece, you've got the glue. Use it. That's your ally. The design. The design is amazing. The design is just incredible, together with the colours and I think is well put together. Um, so uh, that's a pro. One thing that I think is a pro, but you might have a different opinion, so let me know if you do. I find it, it was challenging. There was like some, some bits that I did struggle a little bit and the pieces, because they're so snug, um, it takes a little bit of force, but you need to also be careful and not to break it. So that, but for me, is still a pro because if you're buying a DIY kit, you do expect at least some sort of degree of challenge, whether the challenge that this kit gives you is higher than the level that you expect, then that's another matter. But I still enjoyed it. It was challenging because on this kit, you also need to cut some of the little dowels, the wood dial, dowels. And I found that um, not straightforward and not easy going. So it's one bit that I didn't particularly enjoy, but overall, I loved it. I just loved making this kit and I will make it again and again and again to the point that I've already got another one lined up. So make sure you check it out when it comes out. If you're not a patient person, then you're gonna be struggling with this. That's the only con I can think about. That's the only thing that maybe goes against this beautiful kit. So overall, this is a winner for me. I absolutely loved it and I would do it again and again and again. And the more, the bigger the challenge, the better it is. And as I said, I've got another one lined up. So at some point, there will be another video. If you got to this point, thank you very much for watching and I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you have, why not subscribe and hit the bell so you can keep up with the next video. Thank you very much. Take care for now. Bye. Bye-bye.